Hello everyone, Chaos here, and welcome to another old school RuneScape video. Now, it has something to do with RuneScape, but it's not technically going to be about RuneScape. And this may not even be for everyone who's subscribed to my channel, but rather a very select few who would like to make their own videos. So I'm going to explain what the process is, and maybe if you want to give this a try, since it is really fun. So I prepared this, uh, you know, I prepared a little list, I don't know if there's like, uh... You know, if uh, anyone is watching like a really small screen or anything. So here it is in a bigger picture. So I'm going to explain all of this and the process I followed it to make my guides, since I'm actually really, really happy that I finally finished my 1 to 99 series, and especially uh, with Leagues 2 uh, along the way, since I thought it was going to prevent me from completing the series in time. So, we're gonna talk about what your guides should be about, uh, something that you could uh, potentially be good at, planning and organize, um, looking for the layout, preparing the video, looking for a script, visuals, downloading material, edit and render, and finally, how to upload and manage the videos. So, let's begin. Now, the very first thing you should know is that, obviously, is... Um, Number one, what is your guide about? So this ties directly into number two, that if you want to make RuneScape videos, I would suggest choosing something that you are good at. So for example, I am a, I am a good, I guess, teacher, and I like to teach others how simple something can be. So in my case, I think making guides was the perfect fit. And, you know, I guess from reading at my, uh, looking at my comments, I think it would be, you know, I think it was a good decision for me to choose going this path. I would never make uh, a PKing guide because I never PKed in my life, uh, maybe like three or four times in the past. Um, but I would never do a guide about something I'm bad at doing. Also, it's kind of weird that some people make 1 to 99 guides when they don't have the 99 itself. I know that there's a lot of people who do it, like really popular uh, videos on YouTube, who actually do it. It's kind of weird, but, you know, it's different reading a guide and making a video for your viewers than actually doing it yourself and explaining how easy something can be, explaining it maybe how you did it. So that is exactly why I wanted to max my account before starting my 1 to 99 series. Now, that said, and you know, that is actually the biggest tip that I have for you if you are going to make a guide, do it about something you are great at doing in the game. Not just for RuneScape, but also in, in anything you want, right? So, now that I know what to do, I am going to show you exactly how I did all of this. So, for example, here I have my YouTube uh, folder, here I have some like uh, other stuff, and here I have my RuneScape folder. So, as you can see, every single one of my videos has their own folder, right? I like to have their own separate like uh, little world for their own. <laughs> as you can see, all of the videos that I have uh, in the past are right here. So. I will show you what the 99s were actually about and all the work and effort that, uh, you know, came into making one of those. So first of all, uh, me making the guide itself was actually, you know, maxing and having a feel of what, you know, everything I have to do in the game, right? In order to make a proper guide. So when that happened, and by the way, I'm only going to focus on my 99 series. Uh, the other videos are just like, uh, you know, even though there are guides, I think I want to, you know, make this example bigger with a 99 uh, series. So let's go to the runecrafting section, right? So here I have, you know, all of the methods for 1 to 99 runecrafting, and I'm going to show you what it took, you know, to go through each of them. Now, when it comes to organize, this is what I mean. You want to have everything ready in a way that you know exactly where everything is, just so you don't have to look through your files and, you know, doing uh, everything. I guess I can make this, you know, a little bigger so you guys can see it. Um, so you don't have to look for everything that you need right away. Uh, I mean, so it doesn't take for you, uh, it doesn't take a long time for you to find what you need, right? So let's see, we have 1 to 99 and then all the, um, uh, all of the separate methods, right? So for all of those, I prepared a script, and as you can see, this script is actually uh, the, you know, the entire uh, 1 to 99 and every single method, and as you can see down here, I don't know if you can see it, it's almost 6,000 words. So for every, so for, for the entirety of 99 runecrafting series, 
I wrote a little fucking thesis like <laughs> that I could potentially submit or something. Uh, most of it is like kind of copy paste, but this is what I mean, right? So this is like the uh, uh, what you guys remember if this is your first time watching a guide on this channel and all of that. And then we have the introduction where I say the room crafting, then what is it, as well as the overview. You also have to give your video kind of a uh, structure and if you want to follow that same format for the entirety of your uh, for your videos I'm guessing for me that's really good because honestly I'm kind of you know I kind of have a uh, OCD when it comes to this so you know I think for me it's like really nice having a structured video for all of the guides that I produce so here I have the guide itself you know what you have to do blah 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 whatever right so now that the script is done for every single one of the, you know, of the methods and the guides, then it is time to record. Now, what I normally use, uh, let me see if it doesn't like have anything, is I have always used the default uh, video recorder for Microsoft, right? So uh, I've always used this one. You just have to, you know, record. And as you can see, we're going to have like a little uh, inception thing here. And I use OBS to record the game itself whenever I play RuneScape. So. Uh, you have your video and audio recording, and then when you record what, uh, you know, both the, well, for my guides at least, when I record the audio as well as the video, it is time to, you know, get to work on the visuals. So, let's go to the 1 to 99 series, and as you can see here, I have all of the material that I needed. So, for all of these, I downloaded, you know, all of these, um, you know, all of the pictures, the Rift Guardian, and then once I have all of this, I was like, mm, okay, so now how do I structure this video, right? So that is where my Photoshop file comes in handy. Um, you know, level card, room crafting, whatever. So as you can see, here I have the kind of, um, you know, the roadmap. So for every part of the video that you saw for the room crafting uh, guide, I would have this, right? So one from 99. And then as you go, then uh, each one of these appear on the video as I mentioned them. So that's what happens with, you know, with that. I'm not really good at editing with uh, Sony Vegas, which I'm going to show you in a little bit. But um, this is exactly how I did it instead of putting all of these arrows in the editor itself, right? So once I have all of these, and now I don't want to save. Uh, once I have all of these, right? I have these things. Uh, now I need the introduction for the, um, you know, for the video. So that is exactly what I have here, right? I have one Photoshop file for my thumbnails, which as you can see is right over here. The last one was the combat guide. Uh, next one, I have the what is it and overview, which is pretty much the same. Next one, I have the level card copy. Oh yeah, this one is basically, you know, the one we just saw. Uh, number four, we have the method thumbnails for the icons. So for example, uh, it's the one that you see for the training methods. Number five would be intro to skilling methods. This is what you see before the video. And finally, I have the requirements if there's any levels or quests. And I do this just so every single video can have their like the same format. And for me, this worked so, so well, right? So after that, right, what, what comes after this, right? Once you have all your visuals, all your material, then it is time to edit. So if I open my Vegas Pro, and as you can see, uh, yes, the cracked version. <laughs> I know uh, maybe we are up to version 17 or something, so that's kind of, you know, I, I, I like Vegas Pro 12. I'm someone who doesn't like change, so this is it, right? So I start putting everything together, right? Like, uh, this is the introduction. Then I go like, uh, today, the 1 to 99 runecrafting guide and, you know, whatever. So whenever that happens, you know, overview, and then we have the day old essence, the Rift Guardian, here we go. And then we start, you know, I start piecing together, cutting the, uh, the audio whenever we do all of this, right? And by the way, I don't think I have mentioned any of this, but I already got through, <laughs> through all of this, right? So I edit the video, right? And uh, I don't know what, let me see, what is this? Oh, this is the, <laughs> this is the number 23, okay. What about this one? Now ah, this is the until 99. Okay, so now that I have all of the visuals put together with my commentary, that's pretty much the end of the video, right? Uh, I could show you some other examples, but this is pretty much it for the entire thing. Uh, let me just go ahead and show you the Earth uh, video, or maybe like the I don't know the Wrath Rune video. So let me see. We have the Wrath Rune project here in Vegas. I'm also going to open this one. Very nice, and. 
Here, instead of just the visuals, as in images, then I have the requirements, then I have the small video here playing uh, what you saw in that video itself. So, um, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much uh, it when it comes to, uh, to to making the video, right? So, after you finish editing the video, it is going to be, you know, obviously done and rendered, and then you have your finished product, which is right here. And then you just dump it into YouTube and then you organize it. And here we go with all of the, you know, content that you have seen so far. So if you want to look at it this way, this is not exactly, you know, okay, how, how do I teach you how to make your own videos? This is just kind of to give you an idea of what you need to, to keep in mind when it comes to making videos or guides, if you want to do anything related to RuneScape or any other uh, or any other topic that you would like to make a video on. So those are all of my topics and I would, I guess, recommend doing this. Uh, number one, if you want to share something, like, you know, when I first started doing this, I was like, okay, who the hell is going to watch another, you know, brand new RuneScape, um, you know, an OSRS channel if there are multitudes of them on, <laughs> on YouTube, but somehow, in, in some magical way, how many subscribers do I have at the moment? Uh, 969 people have decided that, you know, my content is good enough for them to watch. And that is honestly just so cool, right? So don't worry about numbers. People, like, if, if you are confident in your work and if you are consistent, people are indeed going to watch you regardless of what you put out as long as you are consistent and as long as you are good at what you do. So. I would recommend giving this a try, um, even if you have the slightest um, kind of desire to do it. Uh, to, to do this, you you don't lose absolutely anything by trying it, and you know just uh, maybe you get something nice out of it. So this is just kind of a video to I, I guess close the one to ninety nine series and kind of show you what I had to do for all of these, right? I think my 1 to 99 ring crafting was like the, the the biggest script that I had to write, but like, let me see. Yeah, because that's the one uh, where I had to do the most, um, uh, the most amount of like guides for everything. So for example, if we go to the na 1 to 99 magic, which is this one, and I pull up the script, then you can see that it's, let's see, 3,200 words. So in total, I would say I did like maybe over, I don't know, maybe over 40,000 words in script for all of those videos. And one of them could take like between two and four hours of production, right? All the way from making the script to making the video itself. So yeah, that's, um, that's how you get into RuneScape video making and how you get into guides. Um, if you have any questions, if you, ever think about trying to do this and if you have it and if you ever need anything any tips any downloadables like if you want obs if you want the vegas pro uh make sure to let me know in a comment and if i you know normally i reply to my comments but if uh, i don't make sure to add me on twitter or you know like uh follow me and tell me hey i have some questions and then i can you know answer them so that is the life of a RuneScape YouTuber, if I want to call myself that, but <laughs> that's pretty much it. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Uh, I'm going to have a couple more videos before the end of the year, before we start the, um, what you call it, the, the Achievement Diary series, which I'm going to have starting in 2021. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So, you know, again, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video, which should come out hopefully on the 14th of December. So have a great day and I'll see you then.